I want to take the time to make this video to show my prowess in my dumbass department, aka I was being stupid, aka I am the dumbass. I, uh, the starter in this car was being a little sluggish, windows coming up and down the car were being a little sluggish, I figured maybe it's a battery issue. And uh, so I took the battery of my Volkswagen, which apparently looks exactly the same, but the polarities are different, so guess what I did? I crossed it. And the car would turn on, nothing happens. So I thought it was the uh, the main fuse that was here. They talk online about the main fuse, which is this one. I replaced it. Nothing happened. And then they were talking about some number 80 fuse that apparently is on the positive side of the uh, battery and found it. That's the one. It's this fuse right here. It actually has a little cap. I destroyed it. And if you look closely, you can see the fuse is blown. See? Not blown. Complete. Blown. There's a link. No link. So, if you happen to cross batteries on a car, especially a modern one, that have these fancy positive terminals, most likely you blew the number 80 fuse. If you hear a pop, yeah, that's what it is. So, yeah, I just want to educate everybody on what, what I did. And if you happen to do it, you know how to fix it, at least in modern cars. Older cars have something called the fusible link, something like that. You might have to Google it, but uh, just find out my car doesn't have that. It has a fancy uh, fuse like this. Probably be like 40 bucks, I bet. Anyway, thanks for watching. I just want to show you, you know, again, my prowess of my dumbass department. Thank you.